something. Maybe a balsam fur. <clears throat> These river paths, and I've run into a bunch of them at this point, kind of reintroduce the corridors of movement from the pre-Columbian times when the rivers were the highway. very good alternate system for those who want to minimize their road risk. There's not a lot to like about pedaling a bike on the streets around here. Well, here's our tribute to the Green Diner. Had another opportunity to Doing. Looks like we got a lot of algae, duckweed, something.
this is definitely a floodplain. Dabbling ducks. A little sand along the base, some eel grass. Should be running into that bridge soon. Seems like we're having a shift transition where the dog walkers are heading home for dinner. The joggers are getting on with their Saturday. And now it's the bicyclist actually going places. And another boardwalk buckets. Ah, there's the bridge. Let's see, is it functional? We shall see. In which case, I'll happily get over to the Watertown side and resume exploration there. Yeah, this is a completely different style of comfy bench. And kind of a little mini suspension bridge. And what is up ahead? Kind of a return to the street, it looks like. I have indeed <coughs> found the bridge. It's got some Canada's guarding it. Very healthy looking stands of eelgrass. There's some even close to the surface. Like the water level has gone down. 
Now this is kind of interesting. I remember this old neighborhood in Newton. And this is kind of a feeder stream that they culverted for a while. And look at all the sand. The only way this makes sense, since I don't believe it's a natural sandbar, is if all of this crap got washed in the storm drains and whatnot down it here. It's kind of what it looks like. Nonetheless, it might actually have some useful purpose. A good uh, nesting area for turtles or something. <laughs> Yet another duck thinks I have something. It's really insane how they've been they just don't really worry about us. No, Duck, I don't have anything. No. Uh-uh. I'm useless. Sorry, you look so forlorn. Surely there's some duckweed or eelgrass you could be chowing, isn't there? Anyway, stay out of trouble. So this is our... point and I can only assume like I said that it's some kind of outwash from winter road sand or something. Pretty active little stream. Here we have a vernacular swing that I don't imagine the insurance industry would approve of. <laughs> the duck figured out I'm a stiff and is heading back. <laughs> They're smarter than they seem. So yeah. I remember looking at this on satellite and remembering it from when I did work in this neighborhood 20, 30 years ago, maybe 40. But that's it. And I take my leave of little Newton. And say Hello once more to Watertown. <laughs>